In this video, we're going to do a proof over sets using Venn diagrams. So as I said in a previous video, some people call Venn diagrams the Mickey Mouse charts, right? Because you can draw a Venn diagram that looks like that, like Mickey Mouse, where these are three different sets, A, B, and C. Uh, what we're going to do is not draw Mickey Mouse, sadly, but we're going to prove various properties and set equalities using a Venn diagram. So in a previous video, we used the element argument to prove uh, a set equality. We proved De Morgan's law. And to do that, we chose a generic element from one of the sets and demonstrated it that it was in the other set. For a Venn proof, we're going to... Um, draw pictures to describe the sets. And then in a future video, we will do algebraic proofs over sets. Okay, so this is the equality we would like to prove. A minus B union B minus C is equal to A minus C. And I'm going to do a Venn proof. And I always find helpful with then proofs to do it by parts and to label it. So I'm going to start with A minus B in this diagram. And that's everything in A that is not in B. So I'm going to shade in A here. All right, but leave out whatever's in both A and B. Okay, the second part of this is B minus C. So I'm not going to worry. I'm going to treat these as two separate diagrams and use different colors, and then I'll combine them. So B minus C is going to be everything in B that's not in C. Like that. And finally, we have the union of these two sets, which says that anything that's colored in here at all is going to be part of this union. So this whole area that is striped, I'm going to add green stripes to just cover the whole area, So that entire area is the union of these two parts. So we've seen that we can illustrate this set as written using this picture. Now, so that's this set right here, illustrated there. So now we're going to draw this other set using our other diagram. So here, this is going to be a minus C, and I'm going to draw more hash marks of A minus C. And that's all that was on that side of the equation. So we look at these two. Are these two, do they have the same area shaded? Well, there's some areas that are the same. Right, this part of A is the same, and this area here of A and B is the same, but we're missing this area and this area. So these are definitely not equal. Clear that up. And if we want to be a little 
uh, rigorous, we could add a sentence. Um, since the two diagrams are not the same. Neither other sets. Okay, so let's do another example. Here, um, I want to show this set here. So I'm going to break it again into parts, and I'm going to say A minus B. And we're going to have A minus B. You want to be neat enough about shading these in that there's no confusion, right? If you kind of went like that, well, it's not totally clear. Is this, is this section right here meant to be covered or was that an accident? It's unclear. So you do want to be as clear as possible when illustrating these Venn diagrams. And then finally, we said this part, we have a minus C. So that means we want to subtract anything that's in C. So I'm going to use an eraser and say I want to make sure C is totally cleared. Because that is not included in this set. There we go. And on this side of the equation, I'm going to illustrate it here. We're going to have all of A. minus B union C. Well, B union C is going to be everything that's in B or C. So this is going to be B union C. And we want to subtract it from A. Right, which means I'm going to erase everything that's blue. But there we go. And that is A minus B union C. And notice now our illustrations are the same. So since our illustrations, since our pictures, Are the same. The sets are equal. There we go.